Hi, my name is Steve Cummings. I'm wearing two hats now. Uh, one is as a member of the Oshkosh City Council and the other is a realtor. Uh, my first comments will be uh, I'm in support of a new Oaklawn School for a number of reasons, but the primary reason it's a very financial decision for the City of Oshkosh. Um, if wearing my realtor hat with a, a school such as the current Oak Lawn in that area it makes it very difficult to sell homes in that area. And in fact, it devalues those homes, which uh, is not what we want in the community. The first thing people ask, especially if they have children, their first question when looking for a new home is the schools. They want information on the schools. And it's very hard to convince people to move into an area served by the current Oak Lawn School when they find out exactly the condition of the school. So it's dragging property values down in that section of the city. The other, as I put on my city council hat, one of our responsibilities as a council member is to attract new business and industry to the community. Again, when a company is going to locate here, expand here, or people just move here, again, the first question is schools. And when they see a school in the condition of the current Oak Lawn, their decision to not locate in Oshkosh becomes a fairly easy one. I've talked with people, former people from Oshkosh Corp, for example, in Human Resources, they confirm that. That is why so many people who join an Oshkosh Corporation, for example, purchase homes in the Nina Appleton area. Uh, I've also talked to current or new hires at Oshkosh Corporation and they have said the same thing. One in particular, uh, a young woman who has come here from, I think, the Southwest, said she's the only new hire recently who moved to Oshkosh. The others have gone to Nina or Appleton. What this is going to do long term to the city is going to have a financial impact on the assessed value of the entire city. As a neighborhood gets dragged down financially, it reduces the assessed value of that neighborhood and therefore the entire city, which will have significant consequences on the community down the road. So I encourage everyone to vote for a new Oak Lawn. Uh, this is a financial investment in our community. It's not something we're going to build for the 2012-2013 school year. This is something that is being built for the next 50 or 75 years. So we have to look to the future the future of the community and where the community will grow over the next half century, if not more. Thank you.